In today's video, I'll be showing you how to make these really cool friendship bracelets. So let's get started. To make this bracelet, you'll need four pieces of yarn, each 40 inch, and some tape. To begin with, we'll take the yarn and fold it in half and tie a knot on the loop side. After you're done with the knot, tape that side to the table. Now we'll be spreading these pieces of yarn one by one. Also, make sure to follow this pattern of color. Now, start with the rightmost string, cross over and bring it in the middle between the two yellows and then do it to the left side too. Then the right, then the left and just keep on going with right and left. After you're done with yellow, hold the two sides and pull tight. Now once you're comfortable, Hold the two sides in your hand and start with doing the same thing. Right in the middle, then left in the middle. The way of making this bracelet is very similar to braiding. So if you're familiar with braiding, this should be really easy. After some time, your bracelet should look something like this. Now, we'll take the two sides and tie a knot. Make sure the knot is tight. To secure the bracelet, I'll be using a triangular button. You could also use a regular one. So first, take a piece of yarn and put it in through one of the holes. Make sure that you, you pull the button all the way to the end. Just like that. Now take the same piece of yarn and wrap it around the knot. And then tie a knot. Now you can take out the tape and cut off the excess yarn. To tie the bracelet on, simply take the loop side and put it in through the button. And this is how it looks. To make the second bracelet, you'll need three different colors of thread, each 70 inches, and some tape. Take the thread and fold it in half, then tie a knot on the loop side. Make sure the knot is nice and tight. Then take the loop side and tape it to the table. Now we'll be spreading these pieces of thread out one by one. And make sure to follow this pattern of color. Here I've taken the leftmost string and I'm gonna make a four knot on the string next to it. Pull tight. Also remember to knot twice for every string. Do the same for red, make four and knot. Keep doing that for all the strings. Also, as you can see, I've folded the end of the thread that I'm using. 
You could also do that if you think that the thread is too long to hold. Now after you're done with the last blue string, take the string in your hand and put it on the other side. Again, start off with the leftmost string, make a four, and then pull tight to knot. Then keep doing the same thing and keep going through all the threads. After you're done with the thread, keep it aside. And now we'll be starting with the red thread. It's the same thing. Just keep doing the same pattern. Now we're done with red and again we have placed it on the other side and we'll be starting with blue. We're done with our design and we'll be tying a knot to secure the bracelet. Pull the knot tight. And now I'll be using a regular button to tie the bracelet on. So take a piece of thread and put it in through one of the holes like that and pull the button then take the same thread and tie a four knot and do it once more now we can cut off the excess thread to tie the bracelet on, take the loop side and put it in through the button. Here it is. Thank you all for watching my video. Don't forget to hit the like button, share, and subscribe. Also, comment down below if you like the first bracelet or the second bracelet. Excited to see your comments. See you all next time. Bye.